Hey everyone, happy Saturday. The time is 714. We are off to a really delightful start to our morning. We have a really nice summer weekend on the way. Temperatures actually in the 60s north of the lake and in South Mississippi for parts of South Mississippi at least 73 though in Gulfport 68 in Slidell and 66 in a meet. 80s for the South Shore for the metro area, but even low to mid 70s for our river bayou parishes and even closer to the coast. We have some slightly drier air working in from the northeast, and that's why it's allowed those temperatures to cool off with those lower dew points north of the lake. This morning, nice and dry. We have a few showers moving in from east to west across the sound, so we could see a couple stray showers and rumbles of thunder on the South Shore and for our coastal spots today, especially this morning through the early afternoon, but I really don't think we'll see much rain at all. I have a 10% chance of rain today. So here's a look at that slightly drier air working in as this upper disturbance moves from east to west across the Gulf Coast. So that upper disturbance will be closer to us tomorrow, and that should give us a chance for some passing showers and storms tomorrow. But as for today, with that slot of drier air moving into our region, expecting a lot of sunshine and really no rain. Again, about a 10% chance of rain today. Sunny skies all the way through a few scattered clouds. It will be a bit breezy with that moving in too. temperatures today getting to the lower 90s. It's not going to be terribly humid either. It's a little bit muggy, but not bad. Really a beautiful summer day to get outside. Maybe check out the pool or doing something today. It's going to be just great weather for that. Here's precision cast. Here are a couple of those stray showers possible for our coastal spots this morning and into the early afternoon. Very hit or miss. Large part of the area seeing nothing but sunny skies today. Tomorrow as that disturbance gets closer, a little bit more moisture moves in tomorrow. Here are the scattered storms we'll have around on Sunday throughout much of the day tomorrow into the morning, into the early afternoon. With the storms tomorrow, they will be moving by pretty quickly and it's not going to be a washout. We'll have plenty of dry breaks in between tomorrow, but expect for some scattered showers and storms to be around at least for a good portion of our Sunday with sunshine and heat in between. Typical late August heat getting into this weekend. Tomorrow back in the low 90s, we'll feel a little bit more humid tomorrow as moisture does increase across the Gulf South. Still we're talking about a breezy weekend today and tomorrow. Northeast winds or east northeast winds today and tomorrow around 10 to 15. 15 miles per hour. So this breezy weekend actually making it feel pretty pleasant outside. So what's going on in the upper levels of the atmosphere? We got that upper level low kind of upper level disturbance. It's moving by this weekend moves by quickly gets into Texas by Monday. Really high pressure in the upper levels is in control of our weather. But we do have some changes we've been talking about. A lot of tropical moisture is going to be moving into the Gulf of Mexico, and that should increase our rain chances, especially south of the lake during the new work week. But nothing crazy. Actually, models trending that this area of moisture might miss our area and move more into Texas later in the work week. So we'll see. Hopefully we'll get a taste of that moisture because we need some rain. But here is the chance of rain over the next week, only around 30 to 40 percent Sunday through next Friday. So thinking maybe Wednesday should be our wettest day, but I only have a 40 percent chance of rain for the midweek time frame. And really the bulk of the rain looks like it will be out in the Gulf of Mexico and for our coastal spots getting into the next week. So only about one to two inches of rain is expected south of the lake over the next seven days. And if you're north of the lake, maybe up to a half an inch, but we'll see how things play out now out in the tropics. Also, don't have to worry about anything. Really just the main thing over this week regular weather for us. So that's kind of a good thing. Even with that moisture coming into the Gulf of Mexico, it will make it feel more humid. It should bump up our rain chances, but not expecting any tropical development from that. Here are our high temperatures over the next week in the lower 90s every single day. And like I mentioned, the tropics nice and quiet and expected to stay quiet over the next seven to 10 days. So couldn't really ask for a better stretch of weather as we close out the month of August. Here's that seven day forecast. It will be hot and humid, low 90s expected every day. This week and plan for a few scattered showers and storms every day starting tomorrow.